Hey Megan, it's Wednesday and I just got out of the shower. So my hair is a little cuckoo crazy. Pardon that. Um, but I'm glad you're having a good time with Tanjis, but I'm sorry that you're not feeling well and that you're having some emo and stress and emotional distress and all that stuff. But this two step ass, love the tattoo, love you. Mwah. Um, I am not having a good day. I did not want to make this video. I am, <sighs> I am feeling like there's, there's this person that's let me down and I hate that feeling. I hate feeling like someone that you care about it's not my husband or anything like that, but, you know, somebody that you care about, that you feel like you invest time and, and, you know, your personal emotions and support to, and you invest in their lives and they don't return it. And I know I shouldn't count on people like that, but I just hate feeling like people let me down and I hate feeling like someone doesn't care. Or that someone's so wrapped up in their own lives that they're too busy to see mine. And it makes me upset. Um, and I'm not sure what to do with that today. And unfortunately, you know, the way I was raised, um, my mother was very black and white. And things like, you know, if you had the sniffles or a cut on your finger, and we need to go to the emergency room. So it was either nothing or everything. And, and so sometimes my brain gets in that mode where I'm like, you know what, fine. Then I'm just going to cut myself off from, you know, X, Y, and Z. And then I don't have to worry about them or anybody else. And it's kind of like a fight or flight thing that I have emotionally that I just get so angry and feel so bad about the relationship or so just hurt that I would rather run, walk, not run, run, night walk away and just leave it all as opposed to trying to work it out because I just feel hurt. And you know, it doesn't last all the time. Um, there have been situations where I've just walked away because it wasn't worth it to deal with it. But I have to talk myself into and sometimes other people who are close to me and are good to me will say, Gretchen, you're being ridiculous. Stop it. In fact, Tom just has done that for me more than a few times. Um, my husband does it, does that for me. I have a good friend at work, Joel, who does that for me. Um, and just says, just stop it. It'll be all right. Or, you know, here's what to do. Just deal with it. Stop it. Stop it. <sighs> so maybe that's what I need to do, but... And I just need to stop trusting in that person. I just hate that. Because I don't trust people very easily. And I don't invest myself that easily in people. And so when they kind of abuse that, I just feel destroyed in a little piece of my heart. Oh, that sounds so pathetic. Uh... But anyway, that's, 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 that's today. That in a nutshell is today. So, I don't know. Hopefully you're having a better day. And I will see you on Friday. I love you. Stay strong. Have a good time. And uh, punch Don just in the face for me.